Hello, and now I am playing Fear 2 on Xbox 360 on normal difficulty, and this is a level elementary. And then this enemy in front of us is a possessed one. I'm not in sh not entirely sure of its actual name, but um, I'm just going to have to check the wiki later. Its sole thing is it um, takes control of dead soldiers to fight for it. Now where did it go? There you are. Come back. Come back. The shotgun is the actually the shotgun is the best weapon in the games by far, just in total general. Where'd he go? Did I kill it? I think I killed it. So yeah, out of what I've played of Fear 1 and 3, and I've played the entirety of this game, this is by far the best of the three, in my personal opinion. Uh, you play as a, I think it's Michael Beckett, and it's set straight after Fear 1, obviously. And I'm not entirely sure how to explain it without giving everything away. So weapons I have are the um, assault rifle, a submachine gun, a shotgun, and a sniper. Don't expect me to use a sniper. And the current, current grenades I've got uh, equipped are, ooh, this ghost here. This is why this is my favourite level. This was the demo level. Ghost! I don't know why I'm using the submachine gun. The shotgun's better for spirits. Like in all fear games, you have the power to slow down time, but in this one, in, unlike Point Man in the first and third game, uh, Beckett was not born with these powers, he had them given to him. That'll be the fourth item I missed the first time I played this level. I'm hearing shit. Whoa! No, oh, Jesus! Yeah, if I had ended up doing that top 10 Halloween horror game this year, this would have been quite far up. There's Alma. There's a spirit. There's a ghost. There's a ghost. Boom. This, this, looks, this is like a good movie premise. Exorcist with a shotgun. We've had Hobo with a shotgun. Where's the Exorcist with a shotgun? If the priest had a shotgun, the ending to the Exorcist would have been a lot different. Let me throw. I think and I might encounter soldiers soon. That's blocked. The horrible answer. Oh shit, Salman. Eat shit, Salman. B B B B B B B B B Man, she should really eat something. Oh, she did. Oh god, duck lips. Put me down. Whew. I think uh there's some soldiers coming up now. Time to switch to the assault rifle. Yep, re, re, rep, um, fuck, for what, I forgot what they're called. 
Oh well, I'll just I'll just say it later. I'll just put it in the description later when I check the wiki. Thank God for wiki shit. You send me any grenade? Go. Ban bitches. Heavy bastards. Uh, like most games, melee hits are an insta kill. Ooh, automatic shotgun. No, I am not going to use the pistol. Now this is the best weapon in the game. Good level of gore in this. As always, it is fear. Hold on, what shall I swap for this? I will swap the sniper rifle for this missile launcher. Flip a table in just frustration. And that is why we got the missile launcher. We need the shot grenades to disable its shields. Had too close there. <laughs> Load from last save. Thank God it just dropped me back here. Right then. Shot grenade. Hide like a sissy bitch. Before I can do that. Let me back in the school. And that's it, dead. Whew. I think the only reason I died in the last bit is simply because I was being an idiot. I got too close to an explosive. I'm camp soldiers, that's them. Alright, and somehow we need to go reach that valve, but I will be doing that in this video. Might as well just let the last 10 minutes ride out. This was Fear 2 Project Origin on the Xbox 360 on normal difficulty, the level elementary. Same because we're going through an elementary school. Thank God it's abandoned, I can't do. Bounce the kids in any media. I thought I had an achievement there, it's just one of my mates. So yeah, that was it. Just. Gonna wander around aimlessly for the last 10 seconds. Thank you.
See you in my next vid. Bye bye.